The 0-1 pitch on the way to Edgar Martinez. Swung on the line, that will be a line for a base hit. Here comes Joy. Here is Junior to third base. They're going to wave him in. The throw to the plate will be late. The Mariners are going to play for the American League Championship. I don't believe it. It just continues. My, oh, my. Buhner grounds one to third. A long throw is in time. And the Cleveland Indians, after a 41-year wait, are in the World Series. Up number five, the Mariners lead it two to one. Four one in the sixth. Johnson walks Joe but yellow. And look at the motion of the dugout. Lou Pinella comes out, the trainer comes out. But the early word from the Kingdom is that uh, he just pitched 98 pitches. He hadn't pitched for a while. He was exhausted. Wasn't a back problem. Well hit ball to right field. And there it goes. Ken Griffey Jr.'s 200th home run in the big leagues. Into the bleachers in right field. A three run home run. His torrid pace was interrupted by injury. Junior hurt himself. Junior hurt his hand. And walking right back toward the Mariner dugout, that right hand. Six and two and 11 starts for the Mariners, giving him a combined record of 13 and three for the season. Terry Mulholland, the veteran left-hander from Philadelphia, was also a key part of Seattle's success. Mulholland posted a five and four record for the Mariners. And there it goes. Swung on a high fly ball, belted. That's out of here. Is it in the upper deck or on the roof? It's in the upper deck. Congratulations to Jay Buhner. He has just joined the 200 Club. Was an indication of things to come. The switch hitter belted 12 home runs and drove in 33 runs in just 40 games for the Mariners. Mark belts a ball to deep right field. How about that for a Mariner debut? Fly away. And we are even at 4-4. Four, four. 
A-Rod is seeing the future of baseball right in front of him. <laughs> With this huge kid that plays for the Wisconsin Timber Rattlers who's hitting moonshots completely out of sight. Which hitting Dave Hollins gave Seattle a steady presence at third base and drove in 25 runs in just 28 games. Hollins finished the year with a total of 16 home runs and 78 RBIs. You can feel the magic. You can see the magic. Here's the windup. The one two pitch on the way. Swing and a soft liner to Alex. It's short. Makes the catch to the ball. The Rangers are the American League Western Division champions the first time in 25 years. They come out to thank the fans and despite this one, the Rangers say thank you. Ripken going looking, a fastball in the inside corner. Lazaro when his team needs him most. Holds on to a 2 0 lead through six. My, oh my, what a sight this is! This is unbelievable! I'm gonna give you a countdown from five and we're gonna dig, okay? Five, four, Junior Belton, his third of the night, fly away! Number 13 in April, number 251, my, oh my! There's a fly ball down home, right field line, he might get a cycle out of this one. He's digging for two, and he's got How himself a double. That's the cycle. <laughs> he's gone. Strikeouts for Randy Johnson as the Mariners take it five to nothing, and we'll be back to wrap it up in just a minute. From the Seattle Mariners, second baseman Joey Cora. Batting second from the Seattle Mariners, shortstop Alex Rodriguez. Seattle Mariners designated hitter Edgar Martinez. Driven to deep right center field. Forget about that one. Two run bomb for Piazza. So Jace, who may have pulled off the steal of the day and perhaps the steal of the year. We knew that the Seattle Mariners wanted bullpen help, but how they could trade a top young player in Jose Cruz Jr. for this is a mystery. to 
Mesa Jr. He swings and a high fly ball belt to Green to the track for Wall. Number 56, five mile away. 3 and 0 oh, Jr. Just through sheer brute force. Throw one over the National League sign in the scoreboard. And Ken Griffey Jr. has his 56. And this should do it. David Segui takes Jared Wright's pitch. Deep and gone. Three run shot. Segui's first of the season. Mariners trailing. Seven to four. It's a six. On a check swing. Well hit ball and there it goes. Number 300 for Ken Griffey Jr. One of the youngest ever in the major leagues to reach the three. The 2-2 on the way to Dan Wilson, and a swing and a high fly ball belted deep to left center field, and get off the ride, Red. No, it comes down at the bottom of the wall. Wilson to third base, get off the ride, Red, of the mustard grab ball. It's going to be an inside the park home run. Wilson slides across safely. Bye, oh bye. In his career. Major League Trading Block. The Indians wanted him, the Yankees wanted him, but the Houston Astros got him. Shot Mets score five unearned in the third to have a 6 1 lead. The 3 2 pitch. Swing and a high fly ball right field. Ordonez back to the wall. It might go, and it's gone. A home run for Carlos Guillen. One to one, our score in the third. Caught in a rundown. Eventually, Mariners catcher Dan Wilson is going to throw to the shortstop. Carlos Guillen. Finally, and they're going to bulldog him down. 
who tags Tony Phillips on the play, but Gian is hurt. You see him grabbing his knee. Take another look, and it looks as if Phillips intentionally with his foot drags Gian down on the play. Gian had to leave with a bruised right knee. Remember Gian. The major league game that was special. Here's the pitch on the way. Junior swinging a drive deep to right field down the line. There it goes. Goodbye baseball. He did it. Holy smoke, Ken Griffey Jr. Got him on the breaking ball. Great pitch from Freddy Garcia. A big Uncle Charlie paid a visit. Griffey has done it twice, McGuire twice, Ruth twice. And Junior Griffey sends it back, 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 back. Home and gone! No winner and still champion, Junior Griffey. Batting third, playing center field, an all-century player from the Seattle Mariners, Ken Griffey Jr. It did. When did you know that you were going to throw out the first pitch? When Chuck Armstrong handed me the ball, and look at Speaker Foley. You know, if he had better hands, he should have caught it. <laughs> I got to th get the ball that's down. Right. Bend your back, follow through, get the ball down. That's right. <laughs> Top nine, pods down, 2-1, nobody's on. Jose Mesa walks Ruben Rivera on a pitch way out of the strike zone. Maybe that's why Mesa has a 7.36 ERA. Next batter, John Vanderwall. He gets the free pass. Lou Pinella needs a hug. Next batter, Ed Giovanola. Mesa walks him to load the bases. Pinella's like, Jose, don't, don't. Two batters later, Kivio Veras. Mesa walks Veras to drive in the tying run. Four walks by Mesa in the ninth. Mariners, 13 blown saves this year. Mesa gets the hook. Padres go ahead and a sack fly. This ball game, that pitch is belted to deep left field by Ross Davis, and it will fly away. The first home run in Safeco Field history. My, oh my, it's finally happened in the third game. Fly ball belted to deep left center field. Roll back to the track. The wall fly away. Junior has his first Safeco Field. on Edgar Martinez. And the unit set. One, two pitch to Edgar on the way. Swing and a miss, he strikes him out. Deep to left, a two run over Butch Husky. Oh, give him credit for never taking his eye off the ball, but take another look. Husky never saw the wall coming and ate a lot of Northwest space lines. Later he had to laugh it off. There's the windup and the lefties one two on the way swing and a drive deep down the right field line going and going it is gone goodbye baseball just fair inside the foul pole down the right field line.